video is going to be another baking video and I'm going to attempt to make uh, chocolate covered pretzels. We do these like every year for Christmas. I'm going to try to make them myself and I'll show you guys and walk you around, walk with you about the process and how you do it. So let's hope I do this right. You're just going to need um, almond bark. I think this is vanilla, vanilla flavored and then we do chocolate favorite ones as well. My favorite ones are the chocolate ones, but I am going to do vanilla because I'm going to see if I can food color them and to make them cool colored wax. Okay, you're also going to need golf wax or any type of like food wax. And you're going to take it out and you're going to cut it because then you're going to mix it with your almond bark. If I don't chop my finger off, but you're just going to cut it. <laughs> okay, so I just did little pieces like this and then I'm going to throw them into a pan. And then I'm going to cut up our almond bark next. I just have a pan like this or like a pot and I'm just going to throw it in there. I'm going to do oh. vanilla first. I'm going to do like two big squares. I don't really know how much you're supposed to use. So I'm just going to use two of the big squares for this like this. And I'm just going to throw it in there. All right, I'm gonna throw the little almond bark in the pan as well. I'm gonna light the oven, or the stove, I mean. I'm gonna put it on low heat. All right, so while this is melting, you're gonna get a pan and put some scratch, um, some wax paper on it, and that's what you're gonna put your melted pretzels on. Honestly, I have no idea if this is the consistency this is supposed to be, but I dipped my pretzel in there. It's kind of hard, because this is my left hand, but I'm gonna try to take it out and put it on the tray and we'll find out if it's good or not <laughs> all right so i added some green food coloring to the pretzels because i want to see if i can make christmas green pretzels i don't know i they're not turning out the way i like them i don't really know even how to make them and this is the ones i've made so far it looks like the wax is falling off of them or like the little vanilla flavoring i don't know what i'm doing wrong i'm just gonna keep making them and just see how they turn out because i don't really know what i'm doing Okay, so after asking someone the 15th time for help, someone came and helped me. So now we're going to put, instead of doing it the way I was doing it, we're putting it in a glass bowl and we're going to melt it that way. So hopefully the consistency is right this time. And I'll show you guys what it looks like afterwards um, because I literally scorched the last batch of pretzels. All right, so this is what my first batch looks like. It's okay. They don't have a lot of wax on them on the front. Or like, keep playing wax, chocolate but we're gonna see what the next batch looks like. This is how they should look, completely covered. Mine was not completely covered. So this is what they should look like and they have little smiley faces on them. They're super cute. All right, so now we're gonna melt some chocolate and make some chocolate covered pretzels. Okay, as you guys can tell, chocolate's a lot harder to work with because it's not as melting as fast as vanilla. Um, so now we're having just to like stir it and mix with it kind of well, but it's getting there, but it's definitely a lot harder to mix. All right, so we finally got the chocolate to set for the chocolate covered pretzels. So now we're just making more pretzels and it took a while for it to set. We had to put a lot, a lot of wax in it, but we got it. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video and I'm sorry about the background. We actually have people cutting grass right now and Sasha's barking because there's people cutting grass. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did enjoy me making chocolate covered pretzels, you guys should definitely give this video a thumbs up and a like. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.